These days, virtually every command has a music video. But back in 1989, that was not a thing. At that time, I was the editor of Approach Magazine on my first shore duty, and I was on the fighter flank committee, and I came up with this idea. So I pitched it to the fighter wing commander, and I said I was going to need footage from every one of the East Coast Tomcat squadrons to make it happen. And he supported the idea, put a message on the streets, and most, if not all, of the commands gave me some pretty cool footage. And also, I got to fly with a few of the squadrons to shoot the footage. So when you look at the Fighter Fling 89 video, you can see the VF-31 section takeoff and some of the other stuff. And you can tell VF-31 because their Tomcats had a black nose in those days. But I shot that footage. I also got my friends in the rock band Driving and Crying to give me a soundtrack. The format was so popular that it became a regular thing from then on. And then the second year, my friend Dean Collins and I came up with a soundtrack ourselves. We also did some role playing in that one where Commander Magic Morris, one of my original F-14 RAG instructors, played the fighter pilot Rockstar, and my little brother, who was a bouncer and a male dancer at the time, played his security guard. So that one had two songs that Dean, who was a C-2 pilot, and I wrote. First one was called My Life Story, kind of went like... <laughs> And then that segued into a song that we called Politics of Surfing. Now the last Fighter Fling video that I had anything to do with was the 1992 Fighter Fling video. And again, I did the soundtrack for that one, and that song goes... As a side note, I did not produce the 1993 Fighter Fling video. Some of my fellow RAG instructors at VF-101 did. But my son does have a cameo in it. My, my dad says Tomcats are the carrier. At the time, he was two years old. Now he's 31. Now, the other night, my new friend Dennis Tech, who you guys may remember from the real Iceman episode. Dennis was a flight surgeon in the Navy, assigned to a Marine Corps squadron back in the 80s. And he's also been a member of a legendary Australian rock and roll band called Radio Birdman. In fact, Radio Birdman was inducted into the Australian Music Industry Hall of Fame a few years ago. So Dennis sent me this song last night, and he said, I've never used it for anything. And I asked him, hey, do you mind if I make a Fighter Fling video out of it? And he said, sure. So I now present to you Fighter Fling 2022, featuring a song called Press On by Dennis Tech. Enjoy.
All right, that's going to do it for this episode. If you're a first-time viewer, please ring the bell and become a subscriber so you don't miss anything. Give me the likes and comment. Check the links below for merch, including where to get the Punk's Trilogy, my first three novels about life in an F-14 squadron. If you go to usni.org to purchase the books, use the discount code PUNKYT for 25% off. Also, the Punk's Trilogy is now available for the first time as a Kindle. So go to Amazon.com to check that out. If you'd like to help support the channel, please consider using the super thanks, the heart icon below, or become a patron at Patreon.com slash Ward Carroll. In the meantime, I look forward to talking to you again soon.